I really, truly like how Nick Cannon handled himself on this talk show. You know, he really, truly changed my whole conception about him, honestly. You know, I don't know if this the Spirit of God just basically said, you know what, you're not going to do this to my son. I'm going to bring another son to come in and advocate. And it's really about time because... You see the part when he kept on saying, I'm referring to the advocate. He was saying, he still keeps on saying anti-Semitic. He hasn't given specifically what examples that Kyrie had gave as anti-Semitic. Now, I listened to the press conference. I listened to the example, but they're trying to push a false narrative of him, like I said. And now in this situation, I'm glad that Nick Cannon used the word buck breaking. Because it is like buck breaking. Because he said, you're giving a list of all these examples for him in order for him to come back. And then he explained to him. But he seems to me that he doesn't understand what the word was. He know what the word was. And I'm glad that he did that. Because when he told him the explanation of buck breaking, how as a master brings how a master brings a slave in front of other slaves and break that slave in to let that slave understand that he has to be submitted be in total submission under his control you know and to me that was public humiliation of all the lists that they wanted him to do giving him a punishment to try to put him in a position where he has to follow them and I'm kind of glad that Nick Cannon used that word because that was basically it was. And if on my last video, and I remember there was a commentator prior before that, because one of the one of the commentators and even the creators um, even put it to our attention what Buck Brayton was. And I had to refer it to my book, which I did have a slave master who was Buck Brayton, his slaves. And... This, I'm glad that Nick Cannon used that reference, gave him the proper term, and, and and you see, look at his facial expression when Nick Cannon said that, considering the fact that he was well aware what Nick Cannon meant with the word buck breaking. Um, the original video is on TMZ, but I do not watch TMZ because I have took them off the list. But it so happened in Hollywood Lock, you could see the more detail of it. And you should watch it with Nick Cannon defending Kirby Ivan. And I'm kind of glad that he did. And I think that many other celebrities should do the same thing too. To put them in the category to let them know that if your community is protecting you guys, even though they're lying, we're protecting